Yeah, yeah. Actually, these women want to lose mass, not lose weight. If they want to lose weight, all they need to do is go to the equator. They will instantly lose weight due to Earth's rotation. Oh? Is it because they will be like on the treadmill all the time? <laughs> to measure our weight, we measure the upward contact force that's required to keep us stationary. So we stand on the spring and measure the compression force in the spring to be our weight. Or we hang onto a spring and measure the tension force to be our weight. This is how wing balances work. The underlying assumption is that the upward contact force is exactly equal to the downward gravitational pull on us. Because the net force acting on us ought to be zero because we are at rest and we are not accelerating. But are we really at rest? Well, that depends on which part of the Earth we are at. If we are standing at the North or South Pole, our center of mass is indeed stationary. The net force acting on us is zero. So the floor does push us up as hard as the Earth pulls us down. However, if we are standing on the equator, our center of mass is actually moving in a circle with a radius of about 6,400 kilometers, completing one round in every, you know it, 24 hours. That's uniform circular motion, which requires a non-zero net force acting in the centripetal direction, which is downwards towards the center of the Earth. This means that the contact force pushing us up must be smaller than the gravitational force pulling us down. And it must be smaller by an amount equal to the centripetal force that's required to keep us in circular motion at this particular radius and speed. Imagine someone walks from the North Pole to the equator and measures his weight every day. After taking into account the variation in Earth's gravitational field strength due to non-uniformity of the Earth, he will notice his weight reading falling as he gets nearer to the equator. This is not because the Earth is pulling him less and less hard. This is because the ground and him are pushing each other less and less hard. As his motion changes from stationary to circular motion of increasing radius. Papa, if someone walks from the pole to the equator, he will lose more weight from the exercise than from the rotation of the Earth. <laughs> Papa, what if the Earth spins faster and faster? Wow! Best weight loss program ever! <laughs>